mistake? He set out to have a nice swinging time with a nice swinging hustler. A little peekaboo, then some action. As for drinking, Vern brought a jug and Kathy brought two. Only nothing worked out. What happened that night in Kathy's pad triggered eight hours of wild sex and violence. Sex in about every way known to man or woman. And as for Vern, he didn't get what he came after. Not even a little. A taste of hot lead in color. It all happens when four girls in a Hollywood Hills love pad get invaded. On the right, Tony. She's never had a man. What she digs, she's now looking at. Joy, her new friend, has had plenty, but never a woman, yet. A taste of hot lead, violence, and murder. A well-rounded motion picture, often shocking, often revealing in a house of excruciating joy, where the girls do what they want and like it until the men break in. This is one of them, Kelly, he's sex mad. That's the other one, Eddie, he takes what he can. Both of them like lots of it, and they like it delivered in weird ways. By their two guns, the men prod the girls into doing what they want. A sex-stuffed gingerbread house. Enter roommates Mitzi and Carol. The party's now complete. A time to strip down for action and do as told. Just do your thing. Sometimes it might even be fun. Hot lead. Four women in a love pad. Turned into a hideout for two killers. Sadistic men. Sex warp. Men that get her and you've done something. Look out. Women may be meant for one thing, but they can do other things too. And women sometimes win. A taste of hot lead. Vicious, shocking, violent. Weird sex in a plush Hollywood Hills pad. Things happen. See it.